When it fails, it's instantaneous. There's no warning, no time to escape the building, and it just doesn't break. It sometimes explodes, and there goes the building. This building type is called a non-ductile concrete structure. Non-ductile essentially means brittle, and concrete by itself is a brittle material. You don't want brittle construction materials during an earthquake because when these structures become damaged during an earthquake, they can suddenly collapse without warning. If you load it to failure, the way it fails is sudden. So you want concrete to have some flexibility, but how do you make a brittle material not brittle? Structural engineers found out that you can put some flexible ductile material in the concrete. Let's put a flexible, strong material such as duct tape on the concrete. Load it to failure and see that the styrofoam has failed, but it hasn't collapsed because of the duct tape. If you were in the building and you see the beam or the floor sagging this much, you know it's damaged and now you have enough time to get the heck out of that building. In practice, instead, they put steel bar reinforcing and concrete